Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your Odoo accounting software and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you mark an invoice paid in your Odoo accounting software? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to log a payment in your Odoo accounting software anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know that sometimes you receive a paper check or sometimes cash and you need to log it in your Odoo accounting software. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your Odoo accounting dashboard. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I've already logged into my account and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to go ahead and log a customer payment, first here on the top, you're going to click on customers. After that, you're going to see a drop down menu and you want to click on invoices. Okay, to log a payment, there's actually a couple of different ways you can do it. First, what you're going to do is go ahead and click on the invoice. Once you click on the invoice, it's going to show you information about it and you can click on this purple pay button. Once you do that, you're going to be able to log a payment. Another way you can do that is back on the invoice list. Instead of clicking on the invoice, you can just check the box next to it. And once you check that box, you're going to see a pay button here on the top center. And once you click on it, it's going to be the same thing. You can go ahead and log the payment. So first, what you're going to do is go ahead and mark which journal this is for. So I'll just leave it at bank payment method. Is it a batch deposit or a manual payment? I'm going to leave it at manual here. You can go ahead and log the amount. So let's say they make a half payment. So let's say they only paid 500 and the payment date. Well, let's say they dropped it off yesterday. So we'll mark that as the second. And then we're going to go ahead and create payment right here. Okay. So make sure all of it looks good. And if so, go ahead and validate the payment that it was received. Okay. Now we have accepted a payment for 500 for the invoice, but if you go back here to invoices, it's going to say in payment. So what's going to happen now is you need to go over here to accounting on the top. Once you do accounting, you want to go ahead and reconcile. Okay. Once you do that, you want to go ahead and look for the payment and then check the box next to it and then click on reconcile. Okay. Once you do that, you're going to go ahead and notate where the payment went. So for me, I'm going to go ahead and say it went to the bank. Here you can go ahead and adjust the tax if it applies. Here you can go ahead and adjust the journaling. Okay, once you've verified all the information, click on reconcile. Okay, quick second later, the page refreshes. Now, if we go back to our invoice on customers and then invoice, you can see that the new invoice has been paid right here. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to log a customer payment and reconcile it inside of your Odoo accounting software, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.